Okay, we talked real quick about doing some personal property. I'll give you a quick look at it. This is a net, uh, separate video. And then we'll go back and do some individual pieces. I hope to get posted like the cars and all. This is a train, a uh, little city setup. We're gonna sell the whole thing. All the trains, they'll be described in your catalog. A wicker buggy, pretty nice item. And so on and so forth. Here's a little potty. older baby chair. All right, here's some uh, toys a little bit later, model toys. We're gonna have some clock videos. Here's one of the clocks. It's real nice, Seth Thomas. Works. Look at this uh, Victorian style marble top dresser. It's pretty nice. John Deere, John Deere, John Deere. It's all over the house. Even my Christmas light set. Here's some horses, some of the furniture we'll be selling. All right, we'll head into the kitchen. Pots, pans. More John Deere. Sterling, I believe. And more John Deere. Couldn't be without it. These are uh, all iron pieces. Some are banks. There's an iron dog. That's a pretty nice uh, piece right there. Collection of bottles. Be sure to read the description on these items. This came out of their Pennsylvania farmhouse. That is a really nice. And I want you to look closely at this clock. Look at the description of it when you see it. It sings all kind of songs. All right, we'll go out to the garage and here's some of the books you'll be needing if you buy some of these tractors and cars. Let's go out and look at a few cars. Whoops, I almost missed these old toys. This is a Betty L dump truck. Real nice. An old typewriter, Underwood. I think I got a few more of them older cars, vehicles. Here they are. These are Buddy L. Some of them, and these are old steel toys. And there's an erector set, and that truck was made from it. All right, I'm in the garage. This is a 1965 Mustang convertible. It's a six cylinder automatic. If you look at the serial number, it could be a 64 and a half. This is a 2004 Lincoln Town car. All selling in the auction. And a few older tools. I'm gonna open the garage door. Just a glance, I invite you to come out to the inspection. I think it's on a Saturday for about four hours. Okay, here's our, um, I believe it's a 65 Ford Step side 250, got a John Deere lawnmower, uh, rear tine rototiller, John Deere 110, it needs a little help. We've got this big vacuum system for your uh, lawn and leaf. They've been using this Miller Bobcat as a backup system for power at the house if the power went out. I don't think it's went out, but it has about 16 hours on it. Here's some of your older collectible tools and then some power tools. All this will be tagged in, in your catalog with a good description. This, uh, a couple of motors, all your shop tools, wrenches, ratchets, little sign collection. I'm gonna have to look up what a Holstein Frisian cattle are. 
Here's a nice dump trailer. I call these gas engines. Some people call them uh, hit and miss. This one's running. And we'll get out here and do a separate video of these older vehicles. There's a corn sheller in the corner. And I've never seen a lawnmower like that. It only has two wheels on the back. It's like it floats or something, but it's a, a goodie. There's your triple tree. And then, this is a 1926 Model T, a Ford Model T. We do have it running. These, they've been sitting out here a while, and I'll try to tell you what I can about those in your description and video of this car. Over here is a 1911 white touring car. You need to read up on white. I think this is a very rare car. Uh, the owner's deceased, but he told his son that this was probably one of only three in the world. I, I haven't been able to verify that. We do have his car running, but it's going to need a carburetor or a carburetor kit or rebuilt or something. All right, and behind me is a 1920 uh, auto car, flatbed truck. Uh, from what I understand, the family was actually using this truck um, up until the 1950s on their farm in Pennsylvania. I've been told this is a shop built car it uh hand it's a hand crank pull it with a rope we have actually drove this car across the backyard and then i have a john deere 60 with a loader where often do you see that it's a gas tractor we've had it running we've had the vehicles all the vehicles in the sale running and here's your arms and there's even a remote cylinder there for you so this is going to be a very good auction, very exciting auction. I hope you will be able to participate. We've got a really nice house. It's in a good location. Things are looking, uh, anybody would want to live here. Hey, I will see you at the auction on the internet terryhow.com